Once upon a time, in a small village nestled amidst rolling hills, there lived a young and inquisitive traveler named May. May had a deep longing to understand the nature of life and find a sense of inner peace. Determined to seek wisdom, she set out on a journey to meet a renowned Zen master known as Master Koji. After a long and arduous trek, May arrived at the humble abode where Master Koji resided. The air was filled with a serene stillness, and May sensed the presence of profound wisdom within those walls. With anticipation and humility, she entered the tranquil courtyard and approached the master, who was sitting peacefully in meditation. With a gentle bow, May spoke, Master Koji. I have come seeking guidance on my path to inner peace. I yearn to understand the true nature of life. Can you shed light on this journey? Master Koji opened his eyes and smiled warmly at May. Ah, young traveler, you seek to understand the essence of life. I shall share with you the wisdom of embracing impermanence. May's curiosity was piqued, and she leaned forward, eager to hear more. Recognize, May, that everything in life is transient, Master Koji began. Just as the seasons change, so do our experiences. Embracing impermanence allows us to appreciate the beauty of each moment and let go of attachments. But Master, May interjected, how can we find peace if everything is constantly changing? Won't we be caught in a never-ending cycle of loss and longing? Master Koji's eyes twinkled with understanding. Ah, May, the key lies in our perspective. When we resist the natural flow of impermanence, we create suffering for ourselves. However, when we embrace it, we find liberation and a deeper appreciation for the present moment. To illustrate his point, Master Koji recounted a tale. Once, in a distant village, there lived a skilled artist named Hiroshi. Hiroshi was renowned for his exquisite paintings, capturing the essence of nature with meticulous detail. One day, a young admirer asked Hiroshi why he didn't paint permanent images. Hiroshi smiled and replied, life itself is a masterpiece of impermanence. By capturing its fleeting beauty, I honor its essence. May pondered these words, understanding the profound wisdom in Hiroshi's response. Master Koji continued, just as Hiroshi embraced impermanence in his art, we too must embrace the ever-changing nature of life. Each moment is unique and holds its own beauty, much like the changing seasons. With this understanding, Master Koji continued, we learn to release attachments that cause suffering, we appreciate the joyous moments without clinging to them, and we navigate the challenging times with grace, knowing that they too shall pass. May felt a shift within her, a newfound acceptance of the impermanent nature of existence. She understood that by embracing impermanence, she could fully immerse herself in the richness of each experience without the burden of clinging or resisting. From that day forward, May embarked on a transformative journey of embracing impermanence. She learned to cherish the fleeting moments of joy, knowing they were precious and transient. She faced adversity with resilience, understanding that even the darkest of nights eventually gave way to dawn. As May continued her travels, she shared her newfound wisdom with those she encountered along the way. Through her example, others also began to embrace impermanence, discovering the beauty of living fully in the present moment. And so, in the village of May's origin, a shift occurred. The villagers learned to appreciate the delicate balance of impermanence, finding solace in the knowledge that life's ebb and flow brought opportunities for growth and transformation. With open hearts and liberated souls, they experienced a profound sense of peace and harmony. In embracing impermanence, May and the villagers realized that life's ever-changing nature was not to be feared, but to be celebrated. They learned to dance gracefully with the rhythms of existence, savoring the beauty in each passing moment. And as their lives unfolded like a symphony of impermanence, they discovered the true essence of inner peace.